Costco on the daily chart. Price is currently trading below that 200 moving average on the daily. If we jump on the hourly chart, it is getting up above that 200 moving average on the hourly chart. So there is some strength coming back into this chart. What I like to see is anticipate the next pullback. I'm not going to be chasing Costco at these levels. I'm going to look for the next pullback. Pullback such as ones like this. Click in front of that pivot high, pivot low. Projecting to this new recent high that provide the first price relationship. Over here, I have another pullback, also similar in dollar amount. In addition, I can use my fib retracements. Clicking from this pivot low to pivot high also provides a 3A2 that overlaps. Zooming a little bit more, this is what I like to see. Costco starts to pull back from this area. From here, it must respect this area of potential support. From here, giving me a trigger to go long on a 15 minute time frame. It must exhibit this behavior where there's nothing for me to do on this chart. Of course, none of this financial advice. Have you subscribed to my Fibonacci Zone newsletter? What you will get, you will get a free mini course with instructional videos on Fibonacci trading, access to high probability setups that I'm buying and selling and why, and also lessons from my life, the victories and defeats to help you grow. I'll leave the link below in the descriptions. Look forward to connecting with you. If you haven't subscribed to our channel, subscribe now. Hit that notification button. Our first goal is a thousand subs. We go over cryptocurrencies as well as US equities. Love to hear from you in the comments area. Talk to you soon.